Hey everyone, Danny Webster here for PocketNet.com, and this is another episode of the Android Application Weekly in which we review five applications in 30 seconds each. So let's get to it. GoWall is a free application available on the Android market that will let you share your uh, excursions through various cities with your friends over through Facebook. So what we can do is we can search for something. So here we can search for coffee in Seattle. So I'll just click search and we can view all the coffee uh, places in the area. So here we can view all the coffee shops or whatnot. And if we go to list, we can also view what others have posted on their Facebook accounts in the Seattle area. So here we can view a map of all the coffee places in Seattle. So I can also go back and I can share my adventures with my friend. DropSync is a light and paid for application available on the Android market that allows you to sync all of your folders and everything pretty much on your SD card or on your Android device with your Dropbox account. So here I'm going to select my SD card and we can select this and I can select where I want it to go. So I'm going to choose Android here and just click select. And now I'll begin syncing my entire SD card with my Dropbox account. So in the event that I ever need to recover anything, I can just download it directly from the DropSync application onto my SD card. Daily Roads Voyager is a free application available in the Android market that will allow you to capture video and photos directly to your Android device while you're driving and this will also record your GPS location as well as your miles per hour. So let's say that you were to get pulled over for speeding or something like that, you can just pull up the file and you can show the uh, court that you weren't speeding. So here I can record a video if I like and this will record it directly to my Android device and I can also upload it later to, to the Daily Roads Voyager so here I can stop the video and I can also select photos. If you like to travel but you don't like to stay in big hotels, then Airbnb is a great application to help you find bed and breakfasts uh, around the world. And here it can view the listings of the top 40 bed and breakfasts. So here it says boot and breakfast and that's in Tasman, New Zealand. So we can scoot over and view some others and it shows the price per night. So if I want, I can just click on here. So now I can book it directly from my Android device or I can also contact the host and get some more information. I can view property details, amenities, and also the location and what other people have written about this particular bed and breakfast. Osmos is a paid for game available on the Android market, so the object of the game is to devour these various objects in space without attacking any of the ones that are red. So for this particular level, we want to try to become the biggest, so we want to float around and anytime we use one of the touch screens, uh, anytime we use one of the touches, our little guy becomes smaller and smaller until we devour more objects. So now we can devour these objects because they turn blue, and if we uh, accidentally run into one of the red objects, it looks as though we are terminated and now we have to start over on this particular level. So this has been another episode of the Android Application Weekly, and if you like our videos, make sure you give us a thumbs up, and also leave some comments down below. The name of this live wallpaper is called Anim GIF, and it's a really cool live wallpaper because you can set your own GIF files uh, so that you can select your own live wallpaper. So let me just go here, and we'll select this particular live wallpaper. So under the settings, we can select our own animated GIF here, so let's just click on that, and we'll use this selected version, and we'll just click out of here. We can apply this, and now you have this particular selected GIF file that you can use as your live wallpaper. To get the download information for all these applications, just follow the link in the description directed to pocketnow.com where we store the QR codes and also the Android market links. Thanks for watching.